Hello and welcome to a casual afternoon glass of wine sitting in the garden and this conversation is about one thing that Dan Hollings teaches in the plan uh, with regards to capital risk management is the other side of the automated grid bots which is being able to hodl some crypto which is what pretty much everybody does in the crypto space and also looking at having about 20% reserve in stablecoin. So if you've been interested in learning about how to earn 10 to 20% per annum, which of course is about, I don't know what even the math is on that, literally hundreds more than what the um, banks will actually pay, then sit tight and I'm going to give you three different ways for you to earn 10 to 20% either on crypto or more importantly on stable coins. So if you're still a little bit fearful around crypto on a whole, then stable coin is um, the equivalent of what is pegged to the standard currencies. And uh, a couple of the platforms I'm gonna share with you will actually even pay you this sort of interest rate on uh, your US dollar holdings or Canadian or Great British Pounds or Euro. So let's dive into it and um, we'll just go and have a look at the web and have a look at the different things that we've actually invested in uh, to be able to earn these sorts of interest rates. So let's just jump over now. So the first thing I want to show you is actually Nexo. I've just opened up the uh, US dollar um, aspect of this. So there's the US dollar coin, Tether, uh, Pax dollar, USDT, all of these are stable coins. But if you wanted to go straight for just US dollar, you can actually be earning up to 12% on any of these stable coins. And if you put that into context with what the banks are paying, I mean, I remember getting a, a message from somebody in Spain saying, oh, if you could e even earn 1% a year, that would be amazing. But uh, most banks are actually earning less than that. And they tend to charge you fees for even holding an account, which is just crazy. So to even just move, if you're not interested in the plan at the moment, you're not interested in doing anything with crypto, you could literally just move your currency over into one of these crypto savings accounts and start earning anywhere between, um, I think it says here, 6 to to 10%. And you can even get an extra couple of percent bonus um, reward if you, what they call earn in kind. So just looking at Nexo on its own, Nexo is um, super stable. It's actually recommended by Dan Hollings in the plan. And um, it comes with its own, you know, restrictions. There are certain countries that can't earn the interest. There are certain countries that can't use the exchange. There are certain countries that can't do the borrow against. They're all sort of different conversations, but what I really wanted to highlight is that this is just one of many ways that you could be earning on what's equivalent to, you know, your, your local fiat currency. And here we're just showing US dollars, Euro, Great British Pounds, and then you can even look at sort of moving your local currency, if it's Australian dollars or Canadian dollars, into one of the other uh, stable coins like USDT, uh, USDC, PAX dollar, etc. So one of the other ways of having a look to see where interest is being paid in the crypto space and whether it be on crypto itself or on stable coins is to go and have a look at any of the exchanges. So I've just logged into our OKX exchange and um, having a look at the different interest rates that are available. Uh, don't like take these with a little bit of grain of salt because there are special sort of aspects to earning those kind of crazy numbers. But to just scroll down and have a look at the stablecoin aspect again, if you're a little bit fearful of crypto and you just literally want to, you know, earn some good interest, then you can be getting, um, there it is, 19.44% on UST, which is a stablecoin. There's also exchanges like Binance, which is a truly global site. Um, I can't show you the Binance US account because uh, Binance US is a little bit different to Binance Global. But again, UST as a stable coin, 21% interest per year. So even if you did nothing else in the crypto space, you just came along to some of these exchanges and you had a look at their, their staking, their earning rewards. Um, you know, it's pretty much as safe as you can get, uh, pretty much even more safe than a bank could be. But if you're wanting to dive into a little bit more of a, you know, semi riskier space, such as the DeFi world, then one thing that we're doing, and again, this is not financial advice, you need to do your own due diligence and have a look at things, but we're 
actually happy to be investing in Midas.investments. Um, you'll find the links to everything I'm sharing here below the video. But what we've actually got here is 13% being paid on Bitcoin. But the stable coin like USDT is 20%. And USDC is 20%. And it's just really interesting. You can actually be earning some crazy amounts by um, stepping outside of the comfort zone to a degree. So I think it's a case of like weighing up what is available in the banking world. Um, and even if you're not ready to be earning daily cash flow with these profits like the, the plan actually offers, uh, let's actually look at our portfolio at the moment. So this is a different part of the strategy with Bitscap. It's earning anything from 1.5% a day down to 0.28% a day. Uh, this one we can't count because it's only just started an hour ago. But um, yeah, it's like you can be earning cash flow with the plan. But if you're not ready for the plan, most definitely look at getting into the space of crypto, whether it be safer with uh, stablecoin or whether it's looking at investing into some of the things that you believe will go ahead in future, like Bitcoin and Ethereum and, you know, some of these other ones listed here. And just buy some and hold it and earn some interest on it. So I hope that's been helpful in looking at the different places that you can earn money. Or oh, one last place to actually consider, which is just super easy all around. I can't show you everything because this is actually a phone app, but the world's fastest growing crypto app is Crypto.com. And they actually have a Visa debit card where you can get up to 8% cash back as well. So you can stake or at least earn some um, interest on your money being held in crypto.com. And yeah, it's just a fascinating app to get a hold of. So all the links are below this video that you can go and uh, check out. But um, one little trick about crypto.com is that for the first 30 days, you get totally free credit card transactions. So if you're wanting to get into crypto quick and easy, then this is pretty much the, the quickest and easiest way to get in. So please use our link. It's a referral link down below this video to come to crypto.com. And you get something, we get something. It's sort of like a win-win scenario. And you can get started with just buying a little bit of crypto, uh, using a credit card with no fees. Eventually, you want to be just doing direct deposits so you don't have credit card fees. But it gives you a way to get into the crypto space and buy some stable coin just so that you can start earning some interest. So I hope that's been some helpful information. Um, again, just go and get started in crypto. Our main mission uh, for Nat and I here at Roaming Income Girls is to help as many people as possible get started in crypto safely and securely and, you know, earning some good money, like actually making your money work for you for a change, which has not happened for pretty much our lifetime if we're relying on the old financial system. If you have any questions, please leave a comment or get in touch with us. And we look forward to seeing you in the next video.